Now over to the Cambodian border, where we meet the men at Yuban Air Base. native drink here is called Mekong. <laughs> you got there just in time for that. It really gives you a lift and you don't have a hanger, you don't even have a head. <laughs> Great drink, it's such fun to take a sip and then sit there and watch your dog tag dissolve. Yeah, we're going to have some oh, of yours out. wonderful. Here. Okay, that's How nice. was your trip? It was a lovely trip. It was very exciting. I'm oh, having such a good time. Oh, we are too. Wow, it's a pleasure. This is a beautiful baby. How long have you been stationed here? Seven and one half months, and I've got four and a half months to go back to the Golden Gate, San I Francisco. See. I see. Oh, well, I have a. You know, actually, our businesses are somewhat the same because I travel so much, you know, and I never get a chance to go home either. As a matter of fact, I haven't been home for uh, close to eight months myself. Where is your home? Well, my home now is in Los Angeles, but I've been uh, filming one thing or another, and I've been away from home. Of course, I won't be home for Christmas either, but uh, I just got to thinking about that in the plane today. Isn't that strange that uh, none of us can really get home? And yet we know it's there, and it's kind of nice to know you have it to go to in a year or two years or whenever the time's up, you know? How many trips have you made with the Bob Hope Show? Is this your first one? Everyone or? asks me that. I don't know why that people seem to think I've been with Bob a long time, but this is my first show. I, I like to take close pictures, folks. Yeah, <laughs> and we're smiling this is great. Anyway, uh, Miss Stevens, we're all looking forward to the show, and uh, we've been waiting here for a while, and everybody's really enthusiastic. Bob says he's got a tremendous show this year again. Yeah. I think he outdoes himself every year. Well, this is kind of a special show. We have some of the finest talent in the United States right here, and, and every the biggest names in the business are here this week, and. Uh, and uh, I'm just so proud to be a part of it. We were talking to Miss Carol Baker a while ago, and I mentioned I saw her in the carpet baggage over here last week in Thai, and she speaks a wonderful dialect of Thai. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> oh, that was impressive. <laughs> Bob Morton, you want to say a few words to Miss Stevens here? Yeah, uh, we're sure glad to have you here. All the guys were just tickled to death when we heard that the show was going to make it. We were wondering for a while if it was going to make it or not. Yeah, we were wondering, too. Uh, we just, you know, we never know from day to day, and uh, it we, we want, of course, to play as many bases as we can, and they've added an additional three to our itinerary. Kind of keeps you on the go, doesn't it? Uh, yes, so we'll be over here a little longer than we anticipated. Where do you go from here? Uh, I never know, dear. I just uh, go where they tell me and do a show when they tell me to do the show. So that's about Another it. base in Thailand, I presume. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And uh, I hope we have the marvelous escort we had today. That was kind of exciting. You like that aircraft oh, yeah. escort, huh? I like the whites of their eyes. I like the smile a lot. Those That's people. our uh, Australian friends. They're located on the other side of the base here. Yes, I know. I just worked in Australia. As a matter of fact, that's where I came from. Uh, I worked at the uh, Checkers Club in Sydney, Australia, for Dennis Wong. What's your latest release on that? Uh... Uh, I, I just um, finished um, recording a, a record with Marty Page, as a matter of fact. And it's a thing called Feeling Good. Well, we'll sure try to get a copy of that and be playing it for you. Well, thank you. And it's certainly nice talking to you. Hey, Merry Christmas. Thank you very much. Merry, Merry much. Christmas to both of you, and God uh, bless you. I have one more question to let yes. you go. Uh, are you due to go back to San Francisco for any kind of performance real yes, soon? Yes, I'll be at the uh, Fairmont Hotel there. And you're going to be there. <laughs> no, not before four and a half months. Would you do me a favor and have yes. one drink for me for I'll San Francisco? Have, yes. Thank you very drink. much. And maybe a long drink. A good drink. About good. 15 minutes worth of beer. Oh, oh, great. Good for you. Merry Christmas to you, too. Yeah, thank you. God bless you. And that was Ms. Kay Stevens. We've got a wonderful cooperation with these people today. They're giving us all kind of their time to get them here on the uh, mic and give us a few words on the Music Hobby Shop, 1570. Well, we're back at the snack bar right now in between shows, and I have with me the base commander, Colonel Bruce K. Newson. Sir, what do you think of the show this, uh, this far? I don't think it could be any better. It's a real tribute to the people that have spent their time and effort to come out here and entertain us. It makes it rather routine Christmas week, a special Christmas week for us. It sure does, sir, and I've noticed that everyone has been real cooperative in giving up their interviews and talking to us on their off time, and uh, the only one we haven't had so far has been Les Brown. I think we'll try to get him after the program is over with. Well, I can't say enough good about these folks, and I'd like to put a plug in for the people who did a little preparation for them. Uh, I've had a lot of uh, accolades from the troop itself for the fine preparation and work that's been done by the local folks. Thank you very much, Colonel Newton. That was great. Uh, Bruce K. Newton, the commander of u -Bon Air Base, and we'll be back in just a little while. And you're tuned to the Music Hobby Shop, 1570, on your dial.
Well, we just been informed that the Bob Hope Show Christmas Show has come to an end at Ubon Air Base. The stars will be coming backstage in just a few moments, and we'll try to get an interview with each of them as they go by. I know there's a lot of the guys who are not going to get to make the show, or didn't get to make the show today, and we're doing this so that possibly they can have a little Christmas cheer also. It's been a real wonderful show, and we'd like to thank the whole cast for all their contribution, even down to the crew chief of the big C-141 that brought them in. And I understand they had a, as we've told you time and time again through the tape, they had a big Australian F-86 two aircraft escorted them in to Ubon Air Base, and they, the stars really got a big kick out of it. Mr. Hope come by and said a few comments about it, and we'll be back with you just in a few moments. Here's Mr. Les Brown and his band renown that's been here with the Bob Hope Show. Mr. Brown, I'm the Gray Fox. I got to see your face every morning at 6 a.m. with your theme song of Leap Frog. Somebody told me about that. Yeah, I sure do. It's a real fine piece. You did a wonderful job here today. You know that that was written by the same fellow that wrote In the Mood? Is that right? And right now I can't think of his name. I wish I hadn't brought it up. Oh, what is it? Joe, uh, Joe, uh, Joe, Joe, Joe. Anyway, the same guy that both in the mood. Well, Mr. Les Brown's been out there in the hot sun. He's getting his first cool drink this afternoon, and we really enjoy listening to his band. We've got a few more albums coming in by the Les Brown band, by the way. Oh, good. And ours is the Music Hobby Shop, 1570 on the dial. Yeah, Thank you. What is the cover? All of them are in uh, talent? Yeah. For the, uh... Do you want to tell him you want me to It's the American, I see. It's just for the bass. Thank you very much, Mr. Brown. Nice to you. Merry Christmas. Thank you, Merry Christmas from Les Brown and his band Renown. And now we're at the finale, and everybody's coming back for a cool drink and something to eat, and it's been a real wonderful show. So until we see Bob Hope again next year, we hope this is the Gray Fox with uh, Bob Morton. And we've really had a good time today. We sure have, and it's real nice to see all these good-looking young girls coming back here. But that's all from the Christmas show with Bob Hope and his troop from Ubon, Thailand.